Hey guys, it's Jessica here for episode 10, and today we are going to be painting a really cool statue. Um, I've had this in my art room for a little over a year. I found it at a thrift store, and I just have not been sure how to paint it, what I wanted to do with it. Um, I knew I wanted to do something kind of funky and cool and different, so I finally decided that um, I'm gonna go ahead and make it a pop art style painting and incorporate it into one of these videos. But instead of just painting it, I'm going to turn it into a comic book character. So I have decided to name her Pop Art Vixen. She's gonna be really, really cool. And she's going to swoop in and paint things in an entirely different way. So I actually went ahead and did some little comic book strip pieces to include just for fun throughout the video. So um, I'm looking forward to getting started. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this one. It's kind of just a funky, cool, uh, different one from what I've normally done. So again, if you like, make sure you click like and subscribe. And um, I hope you have a lot of fun with this one. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs>
Okay guys, so this is going to be the conclusion of this video. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Um, I hope you guys had a blast watching it. Honestly, I'm having so much fun putting these videos together. There's something really cool about watching the artwork happen from start to finish in that faster pace and being able to apply the music and just kind of make it funky and fun. So um, as usual, I'm going to go ahead and show you that final product. She's a little bit heavier than the normal pieces. I did go ahead and clear coat her as usual. Um, you can see that I did that blending in the back. Um, what I wanted to tell you guys too is that whenever I do any of the blending of colors, a really, really great trick, something that kind of saves me every time is make sure you're doing that when the paint is still a little bit wet. Um, you can always go back and add those highlights later on, but most of the time that I'm doing this, I'll put the first coat on and leave it a little bit wet so that I can blend those colors or water is another really great trick just to kind of make everything um, flow and kind of blend just a little bit easier. Um, I wanted to also just for fun show you guys the real sketch and the first version that I did of Pop Art Vixen and cut her out so I could put her on that green screen because now I'm like a super huge fan of the green screen that I figured out how to work it. So um, anyway, like I said, just having a really great time trying to learn all these little tricks and put these videos together for you guys. So again, if you like, please click like, go ahead and subscribe. I appreciate every one of you um, new subscribers that have come on recently. And um, I look forward to seeing you guys the next time and have a great rest of your day.